So Ted, uh, what are we having here? Uh, here we have uh, our electric car which is built in Est uh, Estonia. And uh, it's uh, our first uh, totally built model, uh, but we have uh, done a lot of uh, conversions before. What are the specifications of, of this? Uh, the maximum power of this uh, car currently is uh, 39 kilowatts and the continuous power is 14 kilowatts. And uh, the aim of this car is uh, to be Euro certified in L7E category, which is four wheel motorcycle. And we are planning to start producing this car in quantities 50 to 100 pieces per year. But if interest is more, we can uh, broaden our manufacturing. How about speed, uh, maintenance? Uh, the top speed is 110 kilometers per hour. And the maintenance, uh, uh, we offer uh, two years warranty all over Europe, Europe with parts, with uh, transportation. Uh, but uh, there shouldn't be much uh, troubles with this car because electric cars are very reliable and it doesn't need uh, so much maintenance as uh, regular gasoline or diesel cars. Why would anybody want to buy this car? Uh, because it's a very beautiful car. Uh, because it's very cheap to drive and because uh, it's uh, very uh, good for environment or, or let's say it's not bad for en environment uh, and, and it, it doesn't poison people with emission gases. How many Sev 7s uh, we have in Estonia currently? Uh, currently this is uh, like prototype, this is the, the one we built and this uh, is just finished pr product and we in 2010 we are, are putting this into manufacturing based on customer orders. Why do you think uh, electric cars will become a mainstream transportation product? Uh, because there, uh, there aren't much uh, alternative to going electricity. Electricity is the most efficient way to travel uh, in, in a road or in other way. The, the efficiency is so high and, and it doesn't uh, uh, emit any poisonous gases. So yes, it's a, it's a, it's a green way, uh, like clean driving and it's very cheap. Uh, electricity costs uh, like one euro cent per kilometer or something like this and, and it's really a uh, very good uh, way to travel in city uh, and in highways uh, you still would need a gasoline car but uh, we hope to change this in the future soon if uh, the, some technologies will evolve.